Hi everyone, welcome to video number 7. So we have finished a week of videos and uh, I thank you all again very much for watching these and uh, I will start. So today we will continue to look at Glove Puppet Theatre. I hope you watched the videos I was able to share yesterday. Um, I want to thank all the people who have uploaded these videos. Some of them have done it anonymously. Um, I've never seen a Gulabo Sitabo show live. So for me to see that video online was really precious. Um, I also want to tell you that uh, there is uh, there are many glove puppet forms especially which are really struggling, like the glove puppet form in Urisa, which is called Sakhi Kundai. Um, but uh, there is, there are many possibilities of reviving forms, of uh, uh, ensuring a comeback. And I think this particular uh, movement of reviving can only happen if we as audiences um, especially the audiences of the regions where these shows are performed uh, or the arts community, we demand support to the artist directly. Um, this is something which supports them, which is something which keeps them in the practice. One of the things that is crucial at this moment is a very robust uh, census of the artists themselves, especially of... Uh, the folk theatre forms, the puppet traditional forms. Um, so in some of the states, we have a very fair idea of what's going on. In many places, uh, it's uh, absolutely unknown how many practitioners are there, how many people still perform. And I think uh, it's important to understand uh, that in India, which is such a large country, and um, in the performing art forms, especially I can speak for puppet theatre, uh, where the forms are so scattered across the country. It's not like uh, you have one region in India which is puppet specific. No, not at all. We have about 18 or 19 living traditional art forms. What do I mean by that? So you see behind me there are two Katputlis that are hanging. So most people know the Rajasthani Katputlis, but Rajasthani Katputlis are one of the living traditional art forms of India, puppet forms. And like this, there are 17 or 18 more traditional forms. Um, so many of the states have uh, glove, rod, string, shadow, like Orissa has all four forms. Some have maybe only one form, like Rajasthan. And these forms are in different states of health. When I say health, I mean some are really vibrant and the next generation has taken it up eagerly so you know that uh, continuity is assured. But in other places, uh, there is no next generation because either the form a, has died a natural death or too much interference, and let me explain interference, is when a form is picked up from its region and then it is... Uh, uh, changed to suit certain ideas of the form and of identities of the region, uh, it gets diluted. It, get, it, it doesn't stay relevant in its own space. It has no takers outside of the space. And that has also happened to some of our art forms. Um, and also some, uh, because of uh, a loss of uh, their function, like a lot of them were performed during religious ceremonies or were entertainment, but all-night entertainment. So television took the place of all-night entertainment in many spaces, you know, so or, or the kind of job structures, which are not agricultural anymore. Uh, it's not relevant to have any of these forms which are all-night performances anymore. So at this current moment, uh, it's key that we understand how many practitioners, how many masters, how many puppeteers in different regions. Who are the masters? Who are the young people practicing? Can we support the masters so that they can train more young people? Can we support the really good puppeteers so that good quality work is seen from that region? Can we give scholarships to young puppeteers who are learning their form and will be the future of this form? But to know any of this, uh, 
solid census is needed. Anyways, um, I've spoken enough. Today, the entire focus is on glove puppet traditions, but from uh, outside of India. Taiwan, China, um, many parts of Europe where comedia stock characters are played have spectacular glove puppet forms. And I'm going to share some of my favorite forms today. So enjoy. <laughs> 